Well, hey everybody, we're doing a real quick puppy mush video, and uh, we're going to do two separate videos here. And uh, basically, this is the pups, uh, Beretta's pups, enjoying uh, their puppy mush. Um, this is something we do every day, uh, really important for the pups, uh, as well as as well as Beretta, because what we're doing here, uh, we do this from about two and a half weeks to about four, four and a half weeks tops. And, uh, and it helps the pups naturally transition a lot better into food and water. Um, this teaches them, you know, how to eat food and water. And uh, naturally, it takes away lots and lots of the stress of the pups nursing uh, on Beretta. Um, it's really good also for the pups because they get to bond with me. Um, this is kind of their first way that they bond with me as a breeder. And uh, if you think about it, you know, from my perspective, uh, and the pups as well. The first week, week and a half, all their eyes are closed. They don't know what's going on. They're just nursing on their mother. And of course, uh, Beretta and all the mothers, they take care of the pups really well. And their eyes open, they begin to crawl, walk around a little bit, uh, which was just really about three or, three or four days ago where eyes are completely open and pup, all the pups are beginning to crawl, walk. Uh, so, you know, we're not even really a week, week and a half in where pups are just beginning to enter that discovery stage. These guys, these are new little babies, man. They're figuring it out for the, for the first time. So, this is a very important step um, for the pups because that really this is, this is it. This is the first week of their, of their normal life as we begin the transition into what it means for them to be a dog. Um, and so they begin interacting with me uh, as the first human being that they've ever seen. And it's really cool because the bond that me and the pups develop, the pups develop myself, is, is kind of built around this at first. Who is this guy? He comes in our den every day and he feeds us this, um, this amazing pan of food. We love this guy. <laughs> it's awesome uh, because the pups will naturally, over the course of their development, they bond with me in this way because I'm another caretaker to them. I'm, I'm a lot like their mother, this guy that comes in and gives them gives me this awesome dish of food and teaches me how to eat. He plays with me. He talks to me. He, he just holds me. He babies me. This guy is awesome. Now, of course, the weeks are going to progress on forward and uh, a lot more different things will happen. But they're basically on this for a week and a half, two weeks. And uh, again, it tremendously helps helps their development. And it also helps the mothers as well because they don't have to nurse so hard on the pups because the pups would if we let them. Uh, a lot of programs do, and it, you know it's it's really it's really a shame because the mothers will they'll just naturally instinctively they'll put all their energy into caretaking for the pups and all that that adds up to a lot of stress on the mothers and uh, and the pups will just you know they'll nurse and nurse and nurse and this helps this helps the mothers tremendously because the pups won't just basically kill their mom, uh, nursing, uh, attacking them, just, you know, getting milk as much as they can. This is going to give them a, a good round full meal every day and uh, takes a lot of that stress away from the mother and they're, they're able to still maintain their health. Uh, very important uh, throughout the process of them, uh, you know, both being pregnant and, and now nursing and raising their pups. So it's very, very important also uh, for the mothers as well. Uh, but yeah, this is really cool because uh, what we'll do uh, from this point on as we teach them how to eat the puppy mush every day, uh, they'll have access to their food and their water. And you can see that here with their food bin. Um, I'm not sure how much of that's pulling up on the camera, but their food bin, well, they'll have full access to that. It'll be open and they'll naturally, all of them, begin to eat that food over the course of the next 10 days or so. They'll, they'll begin on their own pace going to the food and eating that same food that of course that we're mixing in with their their puppy mush every day and I'm sorry I'm talking I gotta I gotta get focused on these guys so I can help them eat um, and then the pan will let the mother come in and she'll get to finish it off she gets a good round dose of food too just a, extra you know extra benefit there she's getting some extra fish oil she's getting some extra vitamins and she's getting some milk in her system as well she's getting some of that puppy food that she's already eating but really helps uh, again with the pups and the mothers as well so I'm gonna wrap this video up but basically this is a real quick instructional video um, for for both of you our, our family our clients or customers but also breeders as well for something that they can try to do in their own program it's very simple 
Um, it's very easy to do. You just do it once a day. You just kind of have to get in that routine. But it's huge for the pups, and it's also huge for the mothers as well. It just tremendously uh, adds, adds a lot more health to your program uh, for both the pups as well as the mothers. And, of course, it gives you a, a really unique opportunity and the pups as well to bond with you uh, before they go into the stages when you're really, as a breeder, uh, doing a lot of things with the pups to help develop them and socialize them and giving them exercise. And um, naturally, when we go outside, and which is in about a week and a half from now, when they hit about four and a half weeks of age, after they've had their first round of parvo shots, we'll begin interacting all the pups with the, with the whole pack, with the big dogs, the grown dogs. They'll begin to go outside and interact. And they have that trust with me. They already have that bond with me that they also will have with their mother, of course. And uh, I'll help teach them, basically, right now, it's about becoming a little puppy and a healthy little puppy. And then while they're here, we'll teach them how to become a, ha a happy little puppy, an adventurous little puppy, a socialized puppy. It's this path, you know, this adventure, if you, if you will, of them becoming a dog uh, before they jo join you and your family. So it's very important stuff, and this is one of the things that we do, and I wanted to give you an inside look. We don't normally do a Puppy Mush video, but um, again, this will be kind of a two-fold uh, video, give you an inside look at that, and also to help other breeders try something out. So the four things you need to do Puppy Mush, uh, very simple, some powdered milk formula, Whatever puppy food that you would normally use um, to feed your puppies and the mother, we mix that in. And then we, we put a vitamin treatment, any kind of vitamin treatment of your choice will, will work great just to give them a little bit of extra nutrition. And we also add fish oil uh, to the pan as well to give them some extra omegas. So uh, those are the four things in Puppy Mush and you can kind of see how I'm doing it. After they've been on this for about a week, I won't even have to come in here and do this. They'll smell me coming. I mean, they'll know daddy's in here and he's got he's got my pan of puppy mush food and these puppies will go crazy uh when we're up to that, that about that four week mark and they they know what's coming and they love it um and they look forward to that every day and that bonding time with me and uh, interacting with me and, and uh, getting their bellies full uh, of some really good food so all right we'll go ahead and wrap this up and then uh, i'm gonna let them kind of take a nap and we'll we'll also do another quick video of them hanging out with beretta and just a real quick look at them uh, kind of interacting together i'm gonna come in with the camera and finish it off there so you can kind of get a close-up look at these guys uh, enjoying their mush You over there taking a nap, Red? I see you over there. You're gonna be a big old boy, Blue. Let's put you over here so you can reach it better.